testing testing all right oh she is calling fuck What is up everyone, my name is Dan aka Ragnarok ZS and welcome back to my channel. Today's video we actually gonna play a game, yes finally a gameplay, it's been so long. But I'm back, um, so today we're gonna play a, a early, an early access game called Dreamscaper. Um, so this game is still new, as you can see this Dreamscaper prologue, or prology, I, I don't know how to pronounce that. Yeah. Anyway, Dreamscaper is actually about lucid dream. I think your character is in lucid dream, and in your dream, you become like a warrior, you have a sword, and you can kill a lot of monsters in your dream. Yeah, sounds pretty cool. And yeah, and I did watch like a lot of trailers, and it looks so cool. It looks really cool. It's like 2D. The camera is from at the top. Also, it's got a new setup. I mean, like it's not a new setup. I didn't change my laptop or anything. But it just that uh, I I move my desk. Right now, it's in front of my window. So now it's pretty easy to get like lighting and all. You know, like just gonna use this sunlight. Man, the music is really great. Um, but yeah, right now my lighting is just. It's the sunlight and now you guys can see like all of my room my space you know you guys can see my door my books and all and you guys can still see my bed <laughs> I, I also moved my bed as well so yeah anyway not gonna talk so much um, let's start okay so Dreamscaper is best experience for the game gamepad of course all the game these days is best ex experience for the gamepad the music is really great. Hopefully it's not copyright though. <laughs> Press start or spacebar to continue. Let's go. If you're encountering performance issues, please update your graphic graphics drivers. There are no issues with all NVIDIA drivers. Well that's gonna be a problem because I am using an NVIDIA and all NVIDIA drivers, but let's see if it's gonna run smoothly. I'll tell you that in quality settings, this may take a few seconds. Would you like to play the tutorial? tutorial? Yes, please. Oh, is it gonna be like pixel art? It's not pixel art. It, I think it's like 3D stuff. Yeah, there we go. Is it? Man, this is blurry. Alright, here I am. Okay, uh, this is so blurry. I think because they auto change the graphics WASD to move okay I can't really go anywhere maybe go straight all right F to interact slash pickup nice there we go if you time your combos with the white flashes you will do bonus damage Alright, noted, noted. This actually looks pretty cool. Is is almost like an arena who stuff? Almost looks like a mobile arena, like I hope they actually the, the developer do like a multiplayer server then that will be so cool. But depends on the developer, you know. Okay. The combat looks Kinda weird. It, it it looks kinda weird. Like I don't know, it's just it doesn't look weird, it actually look pretty cool, but it's just kinda confusing. But yeah still. Oh alternate attack is is middle cl click. That's kinda weird, but okay. You can hold both a range and melee weapon. Nice. How? Pick up. 
Range attacks require ammo. There we go. Shift to aim and draw release. Oh okay, that's that's pretty cool. Oh there's an enemy. Nice. Nice, that's pretty cool. Releasing left click during the white flash will do bonus, I know. Okay, the controller and like the aim is kinda confusing. I mean like it's not that bad. It's not bad at all, it's just I'm not used to it. Can equip shoes for what? Oh to dodge. Ow. <laughs> dodge is oh space. I thought that's like shift. Okay, space to dodge. Okay. This is actually pretty fun so far. I mean like this is just a tutorial. Of course there's not really anything exciting but the art style and the way the game looks is just really cool. What is this? Hold to block oh shield. Tap to parry. I'm not really good at parry, but I'll try my best. Nice. Ah oh, shit. Ah oh, that ah. Oh. Nice. So that's how you parry. Parry is like let me show you guys. Like uh like this. Yeah, that's parry. But it's so hard, I'm not good at it. Okay, I'm not gonna hurt my character, but I'm not really good at parry. I'm not that fast, my brain is dumb dumb. <laughs> you can hold two lucid attacks. Cold snap will shatter frozen enemies. What's that mean? Primary lucid attack, secondary lucid attack, alright. So it's Q. Oh, that's pretty nice. So it's like frozen. Ice. Power. Let's go to the next one. Lucid attack. Some rooms will have unique events. This function will fill your lucid meter. Lucid meter. <laughs> okay. Tap. Dream rush toggle. Dream rush slows down time by using lucid energy. Oh. Now that's cool. Damn. It's almost like um, the game super hot. I'm like it's totally different. That game is like first person shooter, but still they have like slow time. Like some rooms will be locked. Keys can be found by smashing destructibles or defeating enemies. Oh, there's a key. You found a key. Nice. I have to unlock. Some destructibles require bombs to destroy. That's a bomb. That's a, that looks like freaking spirit. Spirit ball. <laughs> Zero. Oh, right. Oh, oh, the bomb. Doesn't really hurt me. Wait, let me check. Yeah, it doesn't really hurt me, but it will destroy the place. But just not me. It's kind of weird. I'm like, this is my lucid dream, so yeah. Bombs are rare. Please carefully to maximize their destructions. Alright. Nice. So now I can unlock. Okay. There's like a little puzzle that's gonna be. That's gonna be an, a little annoying because I kinda hate puzzle but I get this type of game going to be a lot of puzzle in it. Pick up what is that? A trap. And fast travel to a previous room. Oh okay. Nice. Oh my did my game crash? Wait, what? Oh, wait. Oh. <laughs> okay, I thought my game crashed just now, but her game is crash. Just crash. Oh, so she was just playing some games. What? Wait. Wait, did I just fall asleep? So. 
Okay, this is just a loading screen. So I just, I just play, my character just playing a game just now. So it crashed. And now she gonna to go to sleep. I thought my game crashed just now. That scared the heck out of me. So now she is actually like, sleeping. This is actually a loading screen. That also like, a good, kind of like, genius to do it like that. That's actually like a loading screen. But it looks like it just, she just falling down to her dream. You know? So yeah, that's pretty... That's pretty cool idea to not giving the player see that it's actually loading screen. Because to some people, loading screens is kind of annoying to look at. And they feel like, oh man, why is the loading screen is like this? Like, why is it so slow? So putting it like that, it does so that the player won't even know there's a loading screen. They thought that, oh, she's just falling, like, very, very deep. So yeah, they just have to wait for a little long, a little longer, without knowing that that's a loading screen. So that's pretty cool idea. Alright, so now I'm in my lucid dream. Now I'm dreaming, just now it's just a game, but I guess it's also like a tutorial, I guess. Or maybe she was playing the game and now she was dreaming. She is dreaming about the game. Because right now, I don't know. I mean, it's pretty cool to, like, do you guys ever have exp experienced lucid dream before? I never have lucid dream before, but if you guys do, then that's pretty, that's pretty dope, you know. If you guys don't know what is lucid dream, you guys can go Google it. You know, uh, lucid dream is like a dream, but you can actually create, like you can think in that dream, and if you can literally create anything in that dream, because usually if like normal dream, you can't really control it, you just watch it like a movie. But if in lucid dream, you can literally talk with your own mind and you can say like, if on a burger, you can create a burger, <laughs> just like that. I don't know why they think about a burger, I think I'm hungry. <laughs> but yeah, literally you can do anything in your lucid dream. Unlike normal dream, you can't move or anything, you can control, you can't control your own body if you're in normal dream. But if in... If it's in a lucid dream, then you can control your body, so, really cool. I'm like, I also experienced a pretty cool dream. I'm like, it's also almost great, like lucid dream. But unfortunately, after that, I hit puberty. I'm like, hey, I never, my channel never intended to be a kid channel, so. <laughs> okay. I don't know where did I just go, or where did I just enter, but whatever I guess. How long have been recording? 18 minutes, that's pretty long. Um, I will end the video soon. I mean, like, this is pretty cool. The game is really cool and I feel like I want to play more, but man, I didn't realize I've been recording for 18 minutes. Frost Fracture, Fracture, 3, 48 damage, 9 second cooldown, freezes, 100% chance for 4 seconds, shatters, frozen, this all just frozen, and Tetherball, successful parries, temporarily boost all that, poison vial, adds poison to all of your attacks, okay, so 3 of them, um, Uh, I think I'm gonna go with this one. Okay then. Um, let's go to the left one. The map is at the top right. I can actually click map. Nice. Cool, cool. Oh, there's some monster. Okay. This is so confusing, but ow ow, a a a. Okay, nice.
that monster looks so weird. Yeah, I parry it. Nice. That monster looks so weird. What the heck is that? It's so tall. <laughs> okay. Let's go down here. Okay, I'm gonna finish them up first, then I'm gonna start talking again. Okay. So I don't know how this game gonna play, but I think like when you die, maybe you're gonna wake up from your bed again. It's almost like a... RPG indie game like that, you know. I guess it is an RPG game. Ow, ow, ow. Can I parry? Yeah, there's not a real parry, but yeah, that's parry. Okay, no, not parry. The platypus. That's different parry. That is from Phineas and Ferb. Parry is the game. Parry, you know. <laughs> Let's put the bomb. Can I unlock all of keys? Oh yeah, I need to destroy this. Okay, I currently destroyed that. Can I destroy this one? Yeah. Get him. Where's the key, man? Did I get the key? No, okay, maybe I need to put a bomb here. There we go. There's the key. What the heck is this? Open. Nice. Knife tree. Swap to unarmed one, okay. Swap. Or swap. Swap. Some <laughs> Uh, Let's see. That is so cool. The art style looks so great. So I currently go here for some reason. Don't know why, but that kind of suck. Because the map shows like that's like a store. I want to buy something. I guess I can't. I also can hold to recycle. That's also pretty cool, not gonna lie. Right then, oh, this tall creature again. It looks so weird, so creepy, man. Oh, man. Die. <laughs> oh, shit, I didn't realize that was the enemy. Perry? Oh, no. Come on, shoot me. Ah, come on. Okay, you can't really parry on this thing, but whatever, I guess. Okay, need to use the bomb. Nice. So I think this is the end, right? Oh no, there's still more. So I guess this is like inf infinite, the world is infinite, so I guess you need to wait until you die, then you're gonna restart it again, so I think I'm gonna leave this video right here, um, let me pause that. So anyway, I think I'm gonna leave this video right here, just tell me in the comment section below if you guys like this game, um, to me, this game looks pretty cool, um, and... Um, it's kind of like missing some stuff. I don't know. I don't know what's the stuff that missing, but I guess it's actually pretty cool. It's, it's enough. Okay, this 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 game is really cool. I guess something that missing is actually the story. I don't know if there's actually any story in this game, but there's still a lot of things that I haven't checked it out yet in this game. There's still a lot of stuff you can do, but I just don't really have enough time for now because. I've been recording for 25 minutes, that's pretty long, I need to edit it, some stuff. But anyway, I hope you guys like it, um, again, this game is still early access, so please don't, don't complain about it too much if there's any bug or glitches, because this game is still new, and this is just like the prologue, prology, prologue, again, I don't really know how to pronounce it. <laughs> 
Anyway, if you guys want to try out this game, you guys can download it in Steam. So anyway guys, um, I also just want to tell you guys that I also play League of Legends and Dota 2. So, you know, I'm just kind of alone, so if you guys also, any Malaysians out there, also play League of Legends and Dota 2, then please tell me in the comment section below and hopefully I can join you guys because I'm alone. <laughs> I'm lonely. I need I need friends. <laughs> but yeah, um, League of Legends. I I have the EU, EU and E, Europe and E server, and Dota two is um, Dota two. Um, yeah, it doesn't really have any server. It kind of sucks that League of Legends. Like you need to choose one server only, and you can't really change it. If you want to change it, you need to make. A new account, so that's kind of suck. But yeah, my account is EU and E server, and Dota two. I will tell you guys my username, all of my username in the comment section below or in the descriptions. So yeah, I also play Skill Wars. Um, you guys know Skill Wars is actually a FPS game, kind of like a Call of Duty clone. Uh, I also gonna tell my username why not. And Eve Online is just a I just play that game when I'm bored and better right real to launch is Minecraft and also Roblox because why not <laughs> anyway that is all for this video I hope you guys like it if you guys like it then please click that like button and if you guys want more gameplay by my channel then please cl click that subscribe button I will truly appreciate it if you guys do that and also you guys can also share this gameplay to your friends you know just tell them to check out this game this early ex new early access game real seriously you guys really need, really need to check it out try it out yourself so anyway i guess i'll see you guys later bye guys my name is jeff